Do you ever tell you anything? Before, you know, like a sign? I think you shrunk. Commander <laughs> hasn't changed. No, he sure hasn't. Are you guys coming? <sighs> Just can't believe it's almost over. Honestly, I'm not looking forward to junior year. <laughs> I'm just happy I'm not going to be a freshman anymore. Oh, one thing I do miss is mom's cooking. Oh, God, camp food sucks. I bet. <sighs> you and Xander getting along? I thought you guys kind of hated each other. Not really. I mean, we used to, but I really got to know him this summer. You think you'll do it all again next year? Yeah, probably. Why, are you gonna miss me? It is nice having the bathroom to myself. <laughs> Though the 4th of July party did suck. <laughs> hey, can I tell you something? Really gonna take Shelly home? I mean, yeah. Someone's gotta take care of her. Plus, I have been researching turtle habitats. Tortoise, you being. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> I'm gonna miss it, man. Yeah, me too. But I am kind of excited to go back to school and see everyone. Hey, can I tell you something? Yeah, what's up? that Bobby Vincent is trying to lead his campaign on recycling? Everyone knows that all the school trash just goes to a dump, like he's literally just making this all up. Mm -hmm. And uh, I don't know what issue I'm gonna run on yet, but I know that it's gonna be better than that. Like, come on. Mm -hmm. Are you even listening? Yeah, um, I'm just going to bed soon. Okay. Oh shit, uh, Tobin's calling me. Are you gonna answer? Uh, nah, I'll just see him at school tomorrow. And I'll see you, you too. Good night. I love you. Good night. Love you. Xander, it's good to see you. It's good to see you too, Lou. How was your summer? Did you go to camp? Uh, nah. Uh, how was yours? It's fine. So, uh, already late on the first day. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, uh, weird being back. Yeah. Well, I gotta get to class, but... 
See you around. Yeah, I'll uh, see you later. Cool. Good morning, South High. We hope you all had a fun-filled summer. As we begin the new school year, Mrs. Deer would like us to announce that auditions are now open for the fall play, Days of August. Please join us in the auditorium tonight for the student council's Back to School Suicide Awareness Assembly. That's all for today. Have a great one out there, Lions. Xander? Hey, Meg. Did your phone break? I haven't heard from you all summer. Uh, yeah, kind of. It's been weird. So, I see you're the new class president. Yep. That, that's cool. Uh, well, my phone's fixed now, if you ever want to catch up. School was really weird without you last year. <laughs> yeah, it was a weird year. I still went to every soccer game. They could have used you. And Tobin. You know the anniversary was a few days ago? Uh, yeah, uh, I'm aware. The assembly we did for him actually went really well. <laughs> you know what, Meg? I just don't want to talk about this right now. Then when do you want to talk about him? I, I don't know. Okay, I, I don't know, but not right now. So it seems like the only other person running this year is Bobby Vincent. <laughs> then it's over. You've already won. Right? Thank you. First stop, junior class president. Next stop, the world. I can tell you've been hanging out with Tobin a lot recently. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's actually been pretty fun. You'd like him if you got to know him. That reminds me, I got us tickets to the carnival. Uh, damn, really? You mean like the one in September? Can't you just buy tickets out the door? Yeah, but I figured I'd just get them now. Isn't it kind of just for little kids? <laughs> You're the worst, Sander. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Olivia. Hey, Xander. What's up? Do you want to go somewhere? Um... Yeah. It's weird being back here. Yeah. Feels like forever. <laughs> Remember that time Tobin broke his arm during that one oh game? Oh my god. <laughs> I almost forgot about that. He was being such a baby, he definitely <laughs> didn't break it. Yeah, but you're still nice to him. Remember you brought over ice cream? Yeah, the same ice cream that me and you ate while he was <laughs> sleeping. <laughs> I missed you. 
I missed you too. And Tobin. Yeah. Did he ever tell you anything? Can I tell you something? Yeah, what's up? I just, I don't really like Meg. Why? I don't know. Like, I'm not sure. Like, nothing unusual, at least. Okay. Do you want to head out? Yeah. Cupcakes would work, and then, hey, wait up. You wanna talk about what happened the other day? I don't know what there is to talk about. Nothing happened. You know what I mean. Like I said, I just really don't think there's anything to talk about. You can't keep living like this, Sander. You never used to be like this. You can't just keep ignoring everyone who cares about you. Just, how could you move on so fast? Are you being serious? Do you actually think Tobin's death had no impact on me or anyone else? When we found out, we had no idea what to think. But unlike you, we had to move on and go back to school and learn how to deal with it instead of hiding from the world. This isn't healthy, Xander! You can't keep living like this! You have to move on! Someone's got to take care of her. Just feels like you would rather spend time with her than time with me. You know, the anniversary was a few days ago. I I'm your friend. We're just good friends. I don't actually feel that way. You know that, right? You never used to be like this. This isn't healthy, Xander. You can't keep living like this. You can't just keep ignoring everyone who cares about you. Yeah, I, I know. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna go back to my cabin now, if, if that's cool. I know I've been really distant about everything. And um, the last thing that I want you to think is I don't care about it. I just, I think of that for a really long time. I just thought people resented me for leaving. And at the time, I just didn't know what to do. So I, I left. And I know that it really hurt a lot of people in the process. And, okay, what I'm trying to say is that I just... Xander. I think that I... I think I killed Tobin. You know that's not true. It's not our fault. I know it feels like we're responsible, but... There's nothing we could have done to have changed what happened. Tobin wrote this for you. I didn't know when to give it to you.
Thanks, Viv. You want to go to the carnival?